begin this video with a disclaimer. If you are allergic to bread mold, or if anybody in your household is allergic to mold in general, do not do this experiment. There is a possibility it could be not necessarily dangerous, but not good for you, so don't do it. Um, on the other hand, if you're interested, watch the video. Uh, we will do an update video at the end of the week or when we start seeing signs of mold. So, what we need is bread, a baggie or a container that you can seal up, and a moist paper towel or a spray bottle. And you want to spray your baggie or the inside of your container, or you can actually sp spray the bread itself. So let's do this. So I'm going to begin by first wringing out a little bit of that water. I'm going to place this in my baggie. This is to get humidity levels up, which is what you want. And then we're going to reach in and grab a piece of bread. Now, I can already see some signs that this experiment should work. Um, but I needed this bread. Okay, so there goes my bread inside the baggie. Now, the nice thing about bread mold is it doesn't need the sun to grow. And because it doesn't need the um, sun to grow, you can put this in a dark spot and forget about it. So, we're just going to leave that right there. And we're going to close up this bread so that we can do our talk about bread mold a little bit later in the week. Because it's actually pretty important, so that's what we're doing. With that, I will let you peeps go. And we will check back on this in a couple days. Bye. So, we are back for another video. Um, actually, not another video. This is a continuation of our experiment. And we have successfully raised bread mold. You can see the dark splotches. The camera is not really picking up the blues. Um, but yeah, that is bread mold. So our experiment worked. So now that we have that, we're going to move. Um, and I'm actually in another video this week going to talk to you about bread mold. Um, so yeah, it's a thing. Um, talk to you later. Bye. Oh, don't forget, if you like this video, um, subscribe. If you do the experiment and it works, let me know. Um, yeah. And remember, if you're allergic to mold, don't do this experiment. Okay? You don't have to. I did it for you. So, there you go. I will talk to you later when we actually do talk about bread mold and what it is. So with that, I will talk to you peeps later. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Um, if you like the results, a little bit gross. Click that notification bell so you know when my next video is coming out. And I will talk to you later.